Hi, I'm O from Loud Noises Production and this is my self-isolation home studio video for recordproduction.com. So I mainly work with rock, metal and pop punk bands recording and mixing, but I also do a little bit of pop and hip hop production as well. I'm fortunate to have an outbuilding at home that's set up with a little mix room and an ISO booth. So I'm going to go through some of the gear in here and how I've been getting through the last few weeks working remotely. So this room is set up around a Pro Tools HD system. I mainly work in Pro Tools HD, but also have Logic and Ableton Live as well, which has been really useful uh, with to and fro in different sessions over the past few weeks. So my interfaces are a Avid Omni, and then I also have one of the older Digi 192s here. Um, Everything comes through a Audience ASP2802, which I mainly use for monitoring, but I also use it for a little bit of summing as well. Monitoring in this room is handled by these Shape Twins, and then I also have my trusty KRK VXT8s. Room's treated and sounds pretty good, but I also use Sonoworks as well, just to make it a little more accurate in here. Um, for other outboards, got a few uh, compressors in here. I've got a Distressor, a Serpent Audio bus compressor, um, a Hairball 1176. Um, what else we got? A Summit Audio TLA50, and then I also have the FMR RNLA. With working remotely over the past couple of weeks, I've been sent a whole lot of guitar DIs um, that people have been recording at home. So it's been really useful to have my collection of amps here and I've been able to do a fair few reamps. As the ISO booth isn't really being used for vocal sessions at the moment, I've got that set up with a couple of 4x12s and some mics in there and that's working really well as an amp room. I think the thing I found the hardest working remotely is not being in a room and working with people. So I've been trying to use FaceTime, Zoom, and also Google Meetings as much as possible. That way I've been able to stay in touch with bands. We can bounce ideas backwards and forwards between one another and discuss the project. Next week for one mix, I'm planning to use audio movers so we can do any mix revisions in real time, despite the bands all being separated in different houses and me being in the studio here. So we really are living in some strange times at the moment, but hopefully this will be over soon and we can get back to working with people in the same room again and going out to different studios. Until then, stay safe and I'm really looking forward to seeing some of your home setups too.